Hi, I'm Alex from Amazon Advisor. How are you? Hi, Alexander. Thank you for having me on your platform. Otto, thank you. Um, I I love you. <laughs> I adore you. Um, but um, I, I want to jump straight in with Athena. Like, what can you share about her? Like, who is she? What drives her? Her surviving the civil rights movement, learning how to be that independent woman from the women's movement, um, taking care of her, her daughter and her grandson successfully, and allowing her daughter to be guided by me to be a successful detective, investigative detective, um, and me not stepping on her, you know, curiosity. And then to be vulnerable and show my aging and possible my mental capacity being, you know, uh, damaged by age and medical and it, everything that's happening to her and how she was taking care of her family. Now they may have to take care of her. And she has a deep secret that can, and we all have them and we have to know when to rely on our confidence and exposing it or not. And it's probably been eating her alive, probably a part of her illness. And then the, the paranormal episodes and events that are happening in her home that never had happened before. Uh, she's been accustomed to using a washing machine that didn't turn into an aggressive monster and it literally ran her out of the basement. You know, these are issues. Is it a figment of her imagination? Is it the, the medical? Is it the medicine? Is it her dementia? What's happening? And so I have these layers of vulnerability that I have to share with little Marvin and the cast and and everyone who's going to see what I have gone through, what legions of of people and women have gone through, and and try to cling to something strong and cohesive and comprehensive, and I'm losing it by the day, and, and I'm not for I can't lose it in my real life. <laughs> I got I got livestock and fencing and coats and and pant, real life, and I have one take, one that's all I have in reality. When I give work with a a director on a piece, that like you you break your a bone and your foot, your leg is one take, one break, and 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 little Marvin had written this incredible script where it's a one take of life. And this is what is required and exhausting. I wouldn't be able to do any more than that. And he's going to pay for my therapy. <laughs> well, I do have to wrap that. But you've actually answered like every question I had. In, in oh, all wow. The <laughs> well, I'm, thank you. I hope I eased your day. <laughs> and maybe, but, but I'm enjoying this effort, this incredible opportunity and to expose and teach and continue the expansiveness of horror and horror of film and theater. So you are helping us and for being a great audience, I can't applaud you more. Well, I can't wait for everyone to see it. I've seen five episodes and they are amazing. So uh, I just, I can't wait for the audience to see it. Thank you, so, thank more you. to come. Thank you.